it's Lindsay from My Crafty Plans. Welcome back to my channel, or if you are new here, welcome. I have a few more goodies from the upcoming Moxie Life Life Planner 2025 launch to share with you. This is part two of my Moxie Life launch coverage. I will link part one down in the description below. In part one, I went over the flagship planner in a lot of detail and shared the majority of the launch day products, but a few things did get mailed to me at a slightly later date just because they had come to the warehouse a little bit later. So I wanted to make sure that I shared these with you as well ahead of launch day. All of these products, both the ones for, that I shared in part one and the ones that I'm sharing today will be available on October 22nd at 1 p.m. Eastern. That is the 2025 Moxie Life flagship planner line launch. Again, check out part one if you haven't seen it already. I will link it down in the description below. A huge thank you to Moxie Life. I'm so honored to be part of the review crew again this year. Moxie Life did gift me my review crew order this year. And as well, I'm being paid a small fee by Moxie Life to help promote their new planner launch. As always, all opinions are my own. And if you know, if you are a regular viewer of this channel, you know that I absolutely love Moxie Life. I use their planner. I use their goal setting system. This will be year four for me in the system. So I'm so honored to be part of the review crew team this year. And if you are shopping this launch and you want to help support my channel, you can use my affiliate link, which is down in the description below, or you can use code MyCraftyPlans to save 10% off your order. Thank you so much for all of your support. Now let's get into the last of these Moxie Life launch goodies that I have. We're going to end with these two toolkits, which I'm super, super excited about. So I'm just going to put them off to the side for a minute. These are the like more goal setting type products that I have. I'm going to share the other accessories first, starting with some of the interchangeable covers. My all time favorite Moxie Life cover, Blackberry Field. So excited that this was available as an extra cover. If you missed my first video, all of the Moxie Life flagship planners for 2025 have vegan leather, interchangeable, reversible covers. So <laughs> that was a huge mouthful. I did a cover swap and reverse one of the covers in my last video, and I'm not going to do it again this time, but all of these are interchangeable. You can peel them off and put them back on. They are also reversible. So the front cover with the floral design here, um, becomes the back cover. You can see the logo there and then vice versa the back cover here Which doesn't have which has the logo then becomes the front cover design So this one's got like this inky leaf pattern and you can see there's no logo on that side This one becomes the front cover there are six new designs for the flagship planner covers this year. So when you pick out your flagship planner, it will come with one of these six designs that you can pick I have this one which is called floral and this one here that is called Dream Big with this yellow uh, gingham pattern on the inside there. Then there's a bunch of different throwback covers that you can choose from if you want to purchase an extra cover. The flagship planners themselves are $78 and that does include a full year of goal setting work and planner pages. And then the extra vegan leather covers if you want to buy any covers to swap out, these are $22. And even the throwback ones are reversible. So this one has like the gray petals on the other side. And then I also have this yellow floral one here. This one is called Secret Garden. And on the other side, we've got like this pretty yellow stripes here. And it says, keep shining, beautiful soul. So super, super cute. Loved these two. So, so I had to grab those as well. And if you like more than one of the launch day covers and you want to pick them up as an extra cover, you can do that for most of the designs. There's six new designs for the flagship planners and of those four are also available just as the covers. The two that aren't available as the covers are actually this polka dot one here, this dream big one. And then also there's like a plain dark green cover that's just called forest. And that one is also not available as an extra cover. But all of the floral, the pattern ones and the quote ones are are available. I went over this in more detail in part one. With every flagship that you purchase through Monday, you get one of these little charms as well. And, and with any order during the launch, you also get the 2020, you get the 2024 reflections notebook, the year end reflections notebook, and that will last while they still have them in stock. You can also purchase both of these things if you if you want an extra one or if you're not buying a flagship planner but you are shopping the launch and you still want to pick up the charm. There are also new vegan leather folios this year that fit the flagship planners. 
It is $58 for the folio and it comes in two colors. This is cream and there's also a navy option, but I just thought that cream was so pretty. And these are so big. You can really just like very stuff these full. Um, they've got like a lot of give in them elastic wise and there's actually two spots for the snap. So these work just like kind of any other folio. They've got a pocket on one side here that you slide your back your back cover into. There's also a pen loop here. And then you have, and then your planner is inside the folio and you've got lots of pocket space here. And there's actually a zipper pouch. And um, one thing that Chrissy, who works for Moxie Life, demoed on our affiliate call was she put in all of her moxi markers, the highlighters and the dot markers. There's no new markers this launch. These are from previous launches, but she actually put them all in this pouch and then zipped it closed and still snapped it. And I was just like, well, obviously we have to try that. So I'm gonna stick all of these markers in here, which first of all, that is like, a, it's a deceptively large pouch. Like I could probably still fit even more pens in there. Uh, obviously this is not gonna like, lay flat at this point because it's got a bunch of lumpy pens in it but you can see that I can still totally get this closed and there's actually still like even more space in here like I could still fit things in here it's insane how much space there has it's also not I mean the planner is really big and this is it, moxie life it's a meaty planner but the vegan leather thing it's not very stiff it it has like a really soft texture to it um, and it definitely feels like you could really stuff this full of things so if you are a folio person this is like a really really nice folio option uh, I while I think it's really cool that this pouch has like a ton of pens in it I think that having the pens in there might uh, might hurt my brain a little bit I, I think I would prefer it to lie a little bit more flat but super useful if you're traveling to pack that up. So I will definitely be decorating this out and putting lots of different things in here and just having some fun. Uh, I also love that it has the folder. So I just put that on the first snap instead of the second snap this time. I love that it has like the back pocket folder too. So you can uh, put like loose papers in there. That's like really great for notes, the kind of accordion folder. Although do be careful if you put anything, like I wouldn't, don't put money in there. There is like a little bit of a hole at the bottom there. If you're gonna put money, you know, put it in the zipper pouch. But anyway, that is the folio. Again, it comes in two colors in navy and cream and it is $58. Next up, we have this Living a Purposeful Life desk easel. Uh, so I, this, you can, it just kind of like folds open and then you can kind of flip through things here. Uh, it's obviously really, that's like a terrible angle, but it sits flat on your desk like the same way that, you know, uh, a calendar of that style will. But, but it says it's got 53 weeks of life coaching tips, mindset affirmations, and reflective journaling prompts to be used with the Moxie Life Goal Setting System. So I love that. Uh, what I was actually wondering before I had this in my hand was if you've seen the new weekly reflections pages in the flagship planner which are here they also got an upgrade this year and now they feature a coaching tip a journal prompt and an affirmation so i did just want to check to see if they were the same or not um, as you flip through so you've got that cover then the back there with this little moxieism there the quote from sierra so yeah, so I am looking at this page here, which this is the week of December 30th to January 5th. So this is the first week in the planner. And I just read through here the coaching tip, the journal prompt, and the affirmation. And the affirmation and the coaching tip here are the same. So this is week one. Week one, it is the same. It's not a different set of coaching tips there. And the journaling prompt there on the back, which you do have space to write on here, um, is actually the same as well. So I don't necessarily think that you need the desk easel and the flagship planner. It has the same information. But if you want this as like a reminder sitting right out on your desk, or if you are using one of the Moxie Life undated products, which don't have the new set of things right here, um, like if you're in the companion notebooks or anything like that, this could be a really great add-on product. Again, this is $25 and it's basically got all of this 
information here that's new in the planners this year. Um, before in 2024, there was just a coaching tip, but so it, all of the new information here is also available in this product. So if you're using anything from a previous year, you can still grab that new information and have that. I also really like that there's space to write on this directly. So you have like space to journal with, and these are actually perforated. So you could keep them together and keep them for the whole year, or you could tear them out. You could tape them in your planner. You could, you know, just tear them off when you're done with them. Um, however you want to do. So that is the Purposeful Life Desk Easel. Super, super cute product, but definitely if you are picking up the flagship planner and you're looking to prioritize which accessories you're getting because you because maybe you don't have infinite budget etc um, this might be one to skip just because it is duplicated information on the other hand if you want the new information and you don't plan on using a flagship if you are using the companion notebooks i do think this is a really great product to pick up now we have what I am most excited for, these toolkits. So we have the quarterly goal toolkit and the annual goal toolkit. These are $16 each and it's just an envelope with Eight, this one has 18 sheets of like worksheets and uh, worksheets and tips and different things in it. And this one has 19 sheets. We're going to do the annual one first. So again, $16. So right on top, first thing you do have is a perpetual calendar that folds out. I kind of love the fold outs in here. The quarterly one has some fold out too. I really just, I think that's really fun. Um, so just a perpetual calendar. This is all on the like super nice Moxie Life paper as well. Same paper that you're getting in the planners. Then we have our goal setting quick tips. So these used to be in the flagship planner, but they came out of the flagship planner this year uh, to make space for an idea garden page. And now they are in this annual goals kit. So you just have those same quick setting tips that used to be in the flagship planner. You can also get these, I think, as a free printable on the Moxie Life website. And then you have a personal values assessment. And this is actually directing you to a website. Um, not, it doesn't look like a Moxie Life website. It says personalvalue.es. Uh, and you can use that to take a value assessment and then... Um, and then write down your values and what it means to me. There's space for five of them. This is actually something that was done in Club Moxie. So if you don't know, Club Moxie is the coaching program that Moxie Life uh, runs. And it is, it's like a, it's a paid subscription service. And it comes with like just lots of extra resources. It's a really, really wonderful group um, if you are looking for basically life coaching information, basically working with a life coach, but in a group setting. So it's not completely personalized to you. It's not one-on-one, -on -one, but there's like a lot, you get a different, there's a different topic each month, like a pretty long lecture, which you can watch. You can go to, which you can watch live. You can watch on repeat, or you can listen to as a podcast. And then there's live Q and A sessions and it comes with like a workbook of stuff. So just really like digging into your goals and living your best life. Oh, and this personal values thing has definitely been used in that group before. So directing you to that and giving you some space to journal on that. Then we have a space here for AM and PM routines where you have space for an ideal routine and a minimum routine. Kind of love that coverage, right? Uh, for me, especially the PM routine, like what is the bare minimum that I can get away with doing? And when I'm like, you know, having a luxurious night in taking a bath and doing all of the things, what is your kind of ideal PM routine? Uh, then we have the compass assessment worksheets. So then you get one of these for each of the eight life areas. It's basically like a little goals worksheet for each of them. Um, so this one is marked as personal and you have space to put your compass assessment score. Then a, a, like some brainstorming space here to make that change and then space to kind of write three goals out for each life category and just sort of brainstorm your goals idea or you could use this as your main goal setting sheet if if you wanted so we have that for each of the life areas they all look the same except you know the color and the life area are different at the top uh there spiritual financial Finally, physical environment. And then you have some questions for your goals here. So again, um, this is two goals per page on that. So we've got four pages of that with just different questions to help you think about your goals. I will definitely be working through this in more detail uh, and just kind of using this to help me set goals and reset goals for this year. So I'm very excited for that. 
Then these last two are actually on thicker cardstock, not on like the regular planner paper. And this is one that says my word of the year. And this one is actually foiled as well. So like a very fancy place to write your word of the year and what it means to you. And then a place to make a personal mission statement. This is also something that was done in Club Moxie, like the creation of a mission statement. So really cool to see some of those tools coming to this annual goals toolkit and again you can pick this up for $16 if you're just looking to go like a little bit deeper with some of your goals pre-work I think this is a really great add-on product or you can even use this in combination with some of the free printables on the moxie life website to just do the whole goal setting system without the planner if that's something that interests you as well again you can find all of the questions for the compass assessment as well as like printable versions of the goals writing pages. All of that is available for free on Moxie Life's website. Now let's take a look at the quarterly tool toolkit. I'm so excited about this. Uh, I'm definitely gonna be using this one as well. So the pages in here are meant to cover one quarter. So I would actually recommend starting this in the second quarter because there's like a lot of reflection stuff in here and I'm already going to be doing the annual, the year end reflections, that whole re annual reflections notebook. Uh, it, I'm going to be working on that in November, December for my January goals for going into it. So I'm probably just going to dive in with my annual goals. But then at the end of Q1, I plan to break this back out and do this. And then if I do enjoy this quarterly process then I would pick up two more of these so that I would have it for the end of Q2 and the end of Q3. Again I don't really think that you necessarily need this um, for the end of Q4 just because you have all of the other reflections work for the end of the year and to set your new goals um, but at the other at the other breaking points you kind of tack this on with your quarterly with your quarterly compass assessment. So again we've got our reset checklist a quarterly intentions page, so taking you back, what are your intentions for the next three months? Then here we've got a fold out of your quarterly goals, so you can break down your annual goals with one extra division step and break them down into quarterly goals, pretty cool. We've got quarterly reflections pages. We've got a quarterly reflections pages. Next, you have these monthly habit trackers. They just say monthly trackers. Uh, and there's actually three of these and they fold out as well. So I think the way that this is intended to be used is that you actually in ignore this the squares so you can write what month it is up top there it does say month and then you can write the different habits or whatever you're tracking down the bottom here. And then it's still seven across by five so you would track this going this way that's it took me a minute to like puzzle this out because I was like how where do you write them then what's this for because uh, to me like I was thinking about like the individual squares but so I think you're actually just meant to do this totally horizontally but that is the way I kind of puzzled that out and you do get three of these so for the three months in the quarter then next we've got these monthly recap pages which are so cute I really like these it's just like what am I watching what am I loving what am I eating drinking creating feeling almost like a little currently spread that you would put in your planner so just thought that was super super cute with the boxes and you do get three of those as well then there is a my ideal week I kind of love the idea of this being in uh, the quarterly thing because I do feel like things do change seasonally and I'm you know my ideal winter week doesn't look the same as my ideal summer week etc so kind of fun that you get to do this and it does say like quarter months up at the top there then we've got three pages of wins and highlights to celebrate and you it's like dated on the top so you could kind of use it throughout the months um, or throughout the month and celebrate all of the little things then three gratitude journaling pages one for each month again these are just long and lined. Then a yes, no list for the quarter. So what am I saying no to this quarter and what am I saying yes to this quarter? And then a seasonal bucket list sheet here, which is just like a blank decorate sheet. So really, really fun set of products. Like I said, I think for the beginning of the year, I'm probably gonna be, for the beginning of the year, the only thing that I would maybe do is set quarterly goals on top of setting monthly goals. But then after that, I will be trying out this product in more depth at the end of Q1, so at the end of March, to get this all set up with 
Q1 reflections and Q2 goals. And then at that point, if I do like this, then I will pick up two more to use throughout the year as well. So that is the quarterly toolkit tool and as well the annual toolkit. And again, both of those are $16 a piece. And that is everything that I have from the Moxie Life launch. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know what you are picking up from the Moxie Love Lunch down in the comments below. If you want to use my affiliate link to shop, that's also in the comments below. And again, you can use code MyCraftyPlans to save 10% off your order. Happy planning, happy new planner season. You can also check me out on Instagram and TikTok at MyCraftyPlans for even more coverage and also regular planning and lifestyle content. Happy planning, happy shopping, and I will talk to you all soon. Bye.